trying this will be like my fourth one or third one this will probably be my third one I've been trying to do them on Instagram but sometimes I'll skip anywho we're gonna get it all done today we're gonna catch up with the other three I believe it was three I'm just gonna say this is four even though I didn't do two anywho today is fashion find Friday by Cindy Peach and today I am rocking this shirt from Rainbow that I got probably five, six years ago. I just save clothes just to be saving them. Some occasion might pop up and I'm gonna be ready. All right, I'll be ready. So this is a crisscross shirt. And it also crisscrosses in the back. And it's like beige and it's not quite like suede, but it's got that suede idea or that suede-like feel. It's extremely soft and comfortable. I bought it in a 3X because I wanted to wear it with leggings. It's, it's big, it's, but you think it fit me, right? But it's big. Anywho, so I love me a pencil skirt. And this pencil skirt is in the color of cocoa. And I got it off Amazon for $13.99. And they have them in all colors. I have to go back and get the rust color because that orange looks so good. So, this is outfit number one on Fendi Peaches Fashion Fine Fridays. Fine Fridays. And this lovely onesie jumper jumpsuit came from Ashley Stewart. And you can wear it off the shoulders. Or you could just leave it up on the shoulders and just put a jacket on. I like to wear a three-fourth length jacket down to like my knees and I'll rock this hat or this hat now this hat is uh, four years old and it came from the Goodwill for $3.99 just a plain old hat. I think it may have came from Rainbow because I did see some of these in there before, four years ago. 
and this hat came from the Goodwill and it was also $3.99. I got this last week and I've been going to this Goodwill and just passing it by, passing it by and I decided to look at it and it has YSL on it. Is that E Saint Laurent or is this hat? It's, it's well made. There's nothing in here that says E Saint Laurent. So I think this hat was made personally for someone and they just threw an E Saint Laurent old school button on it. Let me come close so that you could see the YSL. I don't know if that's real or fake, but it says YSL. So, my floors are slippery. Anywho, I love this jumper. This also came from the same Goodwill, and it was $6.99. You can wear the sleeves up. You know it's a polyester, but it feels so satiny, so silky. Real nice, really thin, and very long. It doesn't have the size in it, but it does say Ashley Stewart in gold on the tag. So, I got this. And this old, I want to say it's a faux Birkin. I'm not sure, but I got it off AliExpress. I think it was less than $15, $17. And I only wore it once and already it's coming apart. I guess you gotta buy a real thing, but I won't be. I thought this purse was really nice. This is the key, the key inside there. And it unlocks the lock that's in there, sort of like a Louis Vuitton. Um, yeah, sort of like a Louis Vuitton. So, but, this is the faux Birkin, I think. And it's so roomy. It's so it's such a beautiful, well-made purse. But the strap, this thing, by being with other purses. But I did have it with this bag. So it was in this little baggie. But it's still like, it's not really coming apart yet. But this part is coming loose. But I love this bag overall. Got a little stain on there. I can't get it off. I tried it on some. But I like this bag. So cute. Okay, so also you can pair it with a red bag. I didn't have an all red bag, but I do have an all red bag. And it's like getting cold. But I'd like a clutch with this. You can do a red shoe. Take the head off. Or you can keep the head on. Anywho. So that's my second outfit on Fendi Peaches Fashion Fine Friday. I'm learning this YouTube thing, you all. So, my button. Okay. Here's the third outfit. And you know I love a pencil skirt. So, this is a faux leather pencil skirt. It was a dress. It was a mock neck dress that I ordered off AliExpress some years ago. For some reason, the Chinese are supposed to be the smartest people in the world, but yet they can't get American sizes right. Hmm. Anywho, I ordered a 2XL. They sent me what they thought was a 2XL, was a little dress that could fit my four-year-old granddaughter. Anywho, so I cut it in half. I can keep the top where I can wear a white um, like shirt with it, less like, frilly at the bottom. And have it as a halter top but the shirt's long right and then I use the bottom as a pencil skirt I just put elastic around the waist and this beauty here is a Fendi fashion fine from the Salvation Army for $4.99 okay so this is what prompts me to do the Fendi fashion fine Fridays this beautiful shirt I've had for over four weeks that I've been trying to show you all. It is so gorgeous and I think it was personally made for someone because you won't find this in any stores. Let me show you the construction of this shirt. I don't even know why they gave it up. 
It must have came from some type of boutique or something. Look at that. Look at that. This is like a halter top shirt. You know, I'm not showing no belly, y'all. It's like a halter top shirt that they just made arms on. So, wow. Just take some material and make you some real big fluffy arms. That is so cool. So, this is that shirt. It is so gorgeous. Either she made this for herself or she personally made it for someone else. And I thought, oh my God, I lucked up on it. And it was only $4.99 at the Goodwill. Full price. I never know when, I know when, never mind. Anywho, so this is the third fit. And this is what prompted me to do my Fendi Peach Fashion Finds on Friday. This gorgeous shirt here. So cute. 